An alliance against violence tonight. Residents and police joining forces to reclaim Avondale from shootings and other violent crime. Nine News reporter Bill Price is live in Avondale to show us why a lot of residents there say enough is enough, Bill. Well, Clyde, as you well know, a lot of us simply don't like to be out very late at night for safety or personal reasons. But here in Avondale, apparently the fear of crime has also uh, taken on new levels. Some residents tell us that living along these streets far too often, they get woken up in the dead of night by the sound of gunshots. Gunshots that they want to see silenced once and for all in Avondale. That's why several dozen of them met earlier this evening for a ceasefire prayer walk from Reading Road and Forest Avenue down Rockdale Avenue to an apartment building that certainly has seen its share of shootings. Now, the church-based Project Nehemiah organized the prayer walk to bring together residents who want a safer Avondale. A mother of three brought her children along because she wants to stop being afraid. But it just makes me a little bit more cautious. So, you know, I pick and choose more when and where we're going somewhere or what we're going to participate in. Um, coming in earlier, staying away from certain streets, which I feel like you shouldn't have to, but the way things are now, it is what it is. Now, walk participants pledged to help various neighborhood programs like block watches, as well as encouraging others in Avondale to cooperate with police. Now, Avondale residents also got some encouraging news today from the Cincinnati Police Department. It intends to add more patrols here in Avondale thanks to a federal grant.